In this video, I'm going to show you how the administrator can see the orders placed by the customer and allocate a driver to pay up the parcel. First, you need to log in as the administrator and click Live Parcels, View Orders. Here you can see we have two orders pending. The reason that these two orders are marked as pending is because these two orders are ordered by accounts having postpaid roles. See here. The order status will be automatically updated to completed when the administrator enters payment for the orders. I will show you how this is done in another video. To see the status of the parcels that the customer has ordered, go to Live Parcels, Parcels, and there they are. We have two parcels with pending status. This means that the administrator have to assign a driver to pick up these parcels from the customer. To allocate drivers to pick up the parcel, you click Live Parcels, assign pick up driver, select the parcel you want to allocate a driver, click assign driver, select the driver you want to allocate the parcels to, click next, click confirm, now you see the two parcels are assigned to the same driver, to check what the driver allocation, go to live parcels, click parcels. If we scroll down, we can see we have two parcels here. The status are both scheduled. This means that both parcels are assigned to a driver and they are scheduled to pick up the parcel. If we go inside, We can see driver 1 is allocated to pick up this parcel and the status is scheduled in here. Let's say we make a mistake and need to change the driver allocation or the driver is not available on that day to pick up the parcel. We can reallocate it by going to Live Parcels, go to Reassign Pickup Driver. Like let's say we want to reassign both of them, click Assign. Take another driver, next, confirm, that's it. When you try to allocate drivers to puzzle, and you see here driver assigned if there's nothing in the list, or if you have added a new driver but it's not in the list, please send us a email or support ticket so we can fix this for you. We need to make uh, small changes on the database for the new driver you have added to appear in here.